Hey guys, this is going to be a BG commentary, a live commentary. I haven't done one of these in a while, so it might be a little bit rusty in the fact that uh, PvP and talking at the exact same time is something that is kind of hard to pull off because I get a little distracted when it comes to either I get too focused on the PvP part or too focused on the talking part. But anyway, I'm going to discuss uh, why uh, this game isn't that fun for me anymore. And I, it's not as fun for a lot of people. I'm not the only one in this boat. I feel like a lot of the veterans uh, aren't having as much fun as they used to have in this game. And I'm going to kind of explain why I'm not having as much fun while I try to kill people. And the reason why I haven't had... Oh, I just accidentally fucking targeted a totem. Whoops. But anyway, the main reason why I'm not having as much fun is because I... The widespread cheating is just really pissing me off. I'm drinking this, whatever. Oh my god, I'm fucking lagging like crazy. Yeah, guys, so I'm lagging like fucking crazy. That's great. Perfect timing. But anyway, the main reason why I'm not having as much fun is because the widespread cheating just really pisses me off. And uh, let me turn this off. Um, yeah. You don't know. Everyone in rated BGs and Rena's is pretty much cheating, especially in rated BGs. For the most part, uh, I hate to say this because I know there's, there's probably some people that legit got their rated BG rating. But I'm going to say that over half of the people have in some way exploited their rated BG rating that are in, you know, really high rated. And that's just because that's just how it is. Like, that's how you get high rated, and that's how, that's really the only way to get high rated. And it's kind of a shame. But anyway, um, let's see if I can kill this paladin here. This lag. I have, like, no shit, like half a second delay here, so this is not fun at all. And I cannot wait until they nerf that shit next patch. It's really gay the healing surge but anyway I was talking to some friends and a lot of the a lot of people said you know the the homogenization of the game is really a big turnoff everyone's got an interrupt everyone's got like that interrupt right there I love my interrupt but I don't like the homogenization of it I feel like I mean I, I'm kind of on the on the I'm kind of like picky I don't know not really picky it's not really the right, the right, the right word but I guess I guess I want a perfect world. I want a competitive game. I wouldn't mind the mo the homogenization if the game was really competitive. But fucking MLG dropped WoW because it's just bad. Like right now, the, it's just not balanced. It's, it's awful, and everyone's just trying to cash in on the game while they can. All the high-rated players, uh, like a lot of these high-rated players, like I, I know a lot of you guys look up to Wreckful, but he just he sells carries. Like he he sells people gladiator in 2200 and he just sells rating to people and you know it's it's really kind of shitty that all the best wild WoW players just play the game for to, for money and to get people ratings it no one really plays it for fun like they used to anymore so it's, that's kind of really shitty and i wish it was like in bc where you know i mean people cheated in bc yes but not anywhere i mean anywhere close to the way people cheat now and the game is just uh, I don't know see in BC they balanced the game or each spec had one talent that you played I just accidentally swiped um sorry I'm fat fingering some stuff because I am uh, just talking while I'm playing but anyway each spec had a PvP or each class had a PvP spec druids had resto rogues had subtlety uh, warriors had arms and pretty much there was only 10 things to balance but now Blizzard wants every spec viable, which is kind of creating a problem. Oh, I thought that guy was still alive. Which is kind of creating a problem because they got more shit to balance. And they got a whole another fucking class to balance with another three specs. So that's kind of a problem for Blizzard. And even... See, I'm kind of on the hinge about this too because my spec was one of the specs that got way better with Wrath when they decided they wanted to make every spec viable. Which... I'm totally cool with because Feral didn't used to be really viable, but I don't know. Like it's just not as. I'd rather it be that it, the game have esport potential than and it have only 10, 10 real playable things than be just an unbalanced piece of shit game in general, which kind of sucks ass a lot. Because even when Feral wasn't viable. In arenas, in high end arenas, because back in BC I was not a high end arena player. I'm not really a high end arena player right now, but I'm definitely above average. In BC, I was not high rated at all. Like, just there was no real high rated feral druids other than Deep, who played feral rogue two v two with a warglaive rogue and had all the best PVE gear. 
and was just a really good feral druid in general, there was really no high rated ferals. I mean, I think Meerkat played pretty high, but you know, the, in, in the big scheme of things, they they just weren't there. You know, I mean, there was a couple people that were able to play it somewhat and kind of you know get around it due to playing with really good teammates or I mean, feral druids were just dead weight for the team. Like, let's be honest, they could have picked up you know a rogue or someone else that was better in like literally every way instead of a feral druid, and that's just the way it was. But <laughs> I'd kind of I'd kind of want the game to go back to that. If it, at least it, at least it was a competitive game in tournaments. Like I know RMP dominated, but you had some other comps you could still play, and at least the at least it was fun to watch back then too. It's better than just seeing wizards cast spells at each other all day and have 50 minute games and fucking have every game decided by damage. That was just yeah yeah. I'm kind of raging at BlizzCon. Uh, Season eight BlizzCon was fucking bad. Like uh, the finals. The, the fin I think every single game in the finals, I think it was like eight games or some shit, was decided by damage. Uh, the, whichever team did the most damage won because the game went on for 47 minutes every single game because everyone was using Bobble and everyone was playing Wizard Cleave. So, yeah, I mean, how exciting and appealing could that make WoW look? I mean, not very. So, yeah, that's, that's pretty shitty, honestly. But, um... Yeah, I just I just fucking did a rake at five combo points. Get on get on my level. But um Yeah, so I'm gonna try to main this shaman. And I just, fuck it, don't need to, I just deep sim down. But anyway, live commentary, failing in PvP. Don't please never ever refer to this video for skilled PvP or like fucking look how to play a feral druid, because this is definitely not the right video for that. So if you guys are having the impression like Ooh, Zyback is, you know, teaching me how to play a Feral Druid in this BG right here, and, you know, whatever. Don't, please don't. Go watch my, like, actual BG videos. I know they're, they're sort of few and far between, but, I uh, yeah, I have some. So go watch those instead. And I wish you could jump on that. You can, I don't think you can jump on that rock. I know everyone tries to do it, but I don't think you can. I've tried to do it, like, a hundred times, and I can never pull it off. But... I think I kind of want to do like BGs like this to kind of talk to you guys because I don't really do vlogs, and I have a lot of opinions. And I think that's why Gamers Digest is so successful is because you know I finally get to express my opinion rather than just do arenas like all the time. And I'm gonna shut up, Melden. I am so impatient. I just want to go in there right now, but I gotta wait for stealth. Gotta wait for that stealth. Ah, and the BG ended. So, yeah, guys. Um, I like to express my opinion. I was uh. Number two in that BG, 156 honor, 153 honor, six killing blows, 24 honorable kills, no deaths, fun shit. Thanks for everyone in this video that helped me. I had like a party of four or five, so thank you guys. I know I was kind of dead weight since I was talking and not paying attention to the game at all. So um, yeah, thank you guys for helping me. Thank you guys for watching. And if you want more videos like this where I kind of just express my opinion about the game, I know this. <laughs> I know this is just a QQ video, like. Let's be honest, I just QQ'd and bitched the entire time, but you guys want BGs, you guys want my opinion on the topics, I, t I put a Facebook topic asking if anyone else was bored with WoW, I haven't had one person say I love the game and I'm having a great time yet, so I have a feeling a lot of people are in the same boat I am, but man, I want this, like a lot of you guys, like I'm not, I'm not hating WoW dude, I wish I could be addicted to it like I was, like back in BC, I used to be addicted to this game, I never went AFK, I never stop playing like I would play this game from sun up to sundown and not tab out and not go AFK that's how much fun I fucking had and I just wish that fun was still there I uh like I want to be addicted so bad again like like that's why I come I, I wish this I want this Star Wars game to be good because I want to play a game where I'm so fucking addicted to it that like I just don't want to stop playing and uh, this game is just not like that anymore and it really hasn't been since for me, since really season seven, season seven was the last time I had a lot of fun in this game. That's because, arguably, season seven was the best PvP season, the best PvP season, of you know, one of the best of the game. And I had a ton of fun. I played it high rating. I know I'm kind of a little biased because season seven was my big break where I really got into the competitive scene. I was number three feral in the world for a while. O overall rating, that overall, not like in just three v three. But I was the overall highest rated in 2v2, 3v3, and 5v5. If you average them together according to Arena Junkies, I was number three in the world for a decent amount of time. 
And uh, that doesn't mean I'm the, the third best feral druid in the world. I was just the third highest rated overall. So don't get that confused. But, um, yeah, so, anyway, I, man, I just want, I want to be addicted to a game again. Like, I was addicted to WoW. And, ugh, I don't know. I guess it's better to, I know this is going to be a shitty reference. I'm not even going to say the shitty reference because it's so gay. I just realized how gay it was going to sound in my head. So I'm not even going to say that. I was going to say it's better to, like, have loved and lost than to have not loved at all. But that is so gay. Ugh, I, I just said it, so I guess I ruined it. But, anyway, um, I guess, you know, I got these guys in my party. They're fucking waiting for me. I guess, you know, I'm being pretty useless right now. But anyway, guys, uh, hopefully this made sense. I've been rambling. It's 5 in the morning. I got some random guys on for a BG. And, uh, yeah, so hope you guys enjoyed. If you want more BG commentaries and if I'm motivated to do a BG, um, give me a topic to talk about in the, in the comments below. And I think, you know, this could be a cool little series where I go into BG just killing people. Don't expect optimal performance and PvP ponage. But I I, can, I feel like I play decently still with, you know, play decently still with a topic to talk about. So if you got a cool topic to talk about in the comments below, let me know what it is. And I will, uh, I'll try to talk about it and do BGs. Because BGs aren't terrible because it's casual. And if you do them with friends, it's fun. Like I'm doing right now, I'm just playing with some guildies. And uh, I like to talk about stuff. I like to give my opinion about stuff. And I've always wanted to do vlogs, but... Um, you know, I, I, I don't want to carry a camera around because that's just awkward. But I like to give my opinion on stuff, so maybe this is the best medium to do it. I just give my opinion on stuff via BG. Because everyone, you guys seem to like WoW PvP a lot. That's obvious. So, you know, and I know you guys like my vlogs, and I don't like the vlog all the time. So I'd rather just, you know, kind of communicate via these means. So, you know, I'm rambling like crazy now. So I'm going to wrap this up. I don't want to keep these people in my party waiting for me for no reason. So I am going to sign off. Be sure to, uh, to yeah, leave a comment. Let me know what you want me to talk about in my next Rated BG commentary if I do one of these again. And that's it. I'll see you guys next time.